مؤثرة للغاية الآن People, calm yourselves. The fire was small and has been contained. Allah's wrath is upon us. Most of our books are safe. The danger has passed. Old man, how did this fire start? Old man? <laughs> Fazil Fahim is old. As old as the House of Wisdom, which he commands. Forgive me, Ustadi. I spoke in haste. Can I help? No. The fire has been quenched by the Watermaster's bucket brigades. Who started these fires? Ruffians, I suppose. Enemies of the Khalifa, to be exact. What sort of books were they burning? It is too soon to tell. Perhaps the caretaker of books would know. I am searching for Ahmad ibn Musa. Ah, yes. He has a workshop here, but I have not spoken to him lately. Peace be upon you, Elder. I shall go. I still need to find Ahmad ibn Musa. But I should also speak to the caretaker of books in the library. Huh. That is a lot of books. Oh, oh, do, do not think I am a librarian. I am a writer. Many of these are my own works. Though I do collect, it is true. This city hides other rare and ancient tomes. If you should find one, bring it here. I'll make it worth your time. Not as yet. Oh, perhaps next time we will both find more than idle words and disturbance. Greetings, Yaham. If I may, where is the scholar Ahmad ibn Musa? Ah, yes. The most adventurous of the Banu Musa. His workshop is right behind me. Thank you, Yaham. Basim, 
hey, nine fingers over here. Nihal, what do you have there, sneak thief? A book. I managed to save at least one from the fire. If they catch you stealing... They cut off a finger. No, wait. A whole hand. That is not funny. Then don't laugh. All right, you are in a mood, and I have things to do. Nothing that concerns you. Oh, secret hidden one stuff. What are you doing this time? Stabbing? Stealing? Stabbing and then stealing? That is your specialty, Nihal. Just because you lost a finger does not mean you've lost your touch. All these tools and books looks like Ahmad's room. But where is he? Ahmed seems to be working on something new, but what? <laughs> Measuring tools, like my father used to own, but these are Ahmed's. The letter says these books are for Ahmad. Another book of poetry by Harib. David would love this. Ahmed always signs his work. This is definitely his doing. Diagrams, machine tools, and other oddities. This is definitely Ahmed's workshop. But where can he be? Pardon me. May I help you? I am looking for Ahmed ibn Musa. Do you know where I can find him? I may be able to help you. Follow me. Is this your first visit to the House of Wisdom? No. A friend and I used to sneak in as kids. We taught ourselves to read in your library. All young people should follow your worthy example. The caretakers who chased us out of the stacks every day did not think so. Merely doing the job. And what did you study in the House of Wisdom? I loved poetry and heroic tales. My friend preferred pagan gods and dark magic. Interesting. <laughs> And did you follow your youthful passion and become a scholar? When the whole world awaits. No. You might say I am a man on a mission. Ah, well. What about your friend? No, no, she... still searches for something. Though what that is, I do not know. A shame. It's not far now. Hurry, hurry. Guns, help! I'm under attack! You, what? you lied! Please, 
Don't hurt me. You led me into a trap. I should slay you where you stand. Spare kindly, Hamid. Then tell me, where is Ahmad ibn Musa? Please, sir. I don't know where he is. Truly, I do not. Then why lead me into an ambush? He... he made me do it. Who is he? Not Ahmad, surely. I don't know his name. For he always wears a mask. And what does this masked man want? He commands me to keep everyone away from the House of Wisdom's dig site. Or else... Or else what? He will hurt my head. Like with the others. Please, spare humble Hamid. Where is this dig site? It's in the wilderness. Outside of the city. Hey, let me draw you a map. Mm. The map should lead me to the dig site. Show me the path ahead. My heart, Yassidi, it fails me. Let me find you some help. Perhaps there is a doctor I can take you to. Too late. Yet, there are still many things I must do. My life's work. A treatise upon the heavenly stars. 
I must get it to the House of Wisdom before my rivals claim it and steal my glory. If you wish, I can deliver the treatise for you. And then there is my beloved son. Today, he and I argued most bitterly. Without his forgiveness, I cannot. I will fetch him so that you can make your peace. No. The treaties first. Help me retrieve it. Please. I shall do so. My father was an architect. He too had his glory stolen by a rival. Sit. I will find the treatise. It has three pages, each separate from the others. Please, find them for me. Nothing can hide from us, Enkidu. Have you found them, Ya Sadiqi? Have you found the three pages? There you are.
Have you found them? Ya Sadiqi? Have you found the three pages? These numbers are beyond my understanding. The wind is picking up. Profundity weighs heavily in my hands. That is all of them. I must return to the astronomer. No, no, my father. He has passed from this life. Ahsan Allahu Azaakum. The spirit left him before I arrived. Though his body remains warm to my touch. We argued earlier. It was my fault. I came to make amends, but I was too late. And you? Who are you? A momentary friend. I retrieved your father's treatise, and now I offer it to you. He said it was his life's work. His... His life's work? Those were his words, yes. I see. And me? What did he say of me? He loved you. Truly, he did. But it was the treatise that mattered most to him. Allah. <sighs> Your work will never see the light of day. It dies here, as does the love I felt for you. Citizens, despite my own goals frequenting the Bazaar today, 